But why some say the moon? Why choose this as our goal? And they may well ask, why climb the highest mountain? Why 35 years ago, fly the Atlantic? Why does Rice play Texas? We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things. Not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone, and one we intend to win, and the others too. Welcome everybody to Zephyr's Travels. Today we're at the Kennedy Space Center where we're going to go behind the scenes and in two restricted areas to see the space mission to the moon. Plan on spending three to four hours in this section of the park depending on how much time you want to spend at the Apollo rocket area. This is a great way to see parts of the space center that you cannot see in any other way. So. Come on aboard the bus and let's enjoy the tour. Launch control for the Apollo mission. This is not a moniker. These are the very consoles we sat at when men first took off to fly to the moon. The tragedy of Apollo 1 had put us a year and a half behind. We were making up for it in one big leap. And we were doing it with a rocket that no man had ever flown before. There are moments in American history that unified our country and shifted our culture. The Apollo moon landings represented one of those pivotal periods. In this area, you get to experience the wonder of the Apollo program, the days leading up to the first launch and the moon landings that followed. At the Apollo Saturn V Center, stand in amazement under a gigantic Saturn V rocket, the largest rocket ever flown, and discover historic moments in the Apollo 8 history and view the legendary artifacts in the treasure gallery. Here, you get an up-close look at the moments and monuments that help America win the race to the moon. These were the mission badges. This is a the space motor home. This is the Apollo 14 capsule. In flight coveralls. Spacesuit maintenance kit. 
Commander's Advisory, Advisor Assembly, Bomb Book, Lunar Scoop, Training Blades. Cast of the Astronaut's Hands. This is Alan Shepard's extra vehicle suit. So, they wear their spacesuits. Litton's suit. These are prototypes. Now this is for the Space Shuttle program in the Spaceship Atlantis. A ship like another, the Space Shuttle launched as a rocket and landed like a glider by transporting astronauts to space and back for over 30 years. In this section, we get to explore the space shuttle missions that secured the future of the Hubble Space Telescope and the International Space Station. Now let's find out what it's like to live in space. Have you ever wondered how astronauts go to the bathroom while they're in space? Well, here's a space toilet that shows you how that actually happens. Let's not get into details, so it's you not know. that pretty. Space toilet. Kind of makes an RV toilet look good. Space station dining. Have you ever wondered how astronauts eat in space or sleep in space? These next two displays go into detail and show you how that actually happens for an astronaut. It's very interesting. And this had to be my favorite display at the Kennedy Space Center. Something I was really looking forward to seeing was the Airstream space van. This is how the astronauts travel to and from the space shuttle. It is so cool and it's nothing that makes me think of the space shuttle days and seeing this van. Is that Orion? Must be. Sure, just in time for the butt shot of Orion. Well guys, this concludes our day at uh, the Kennedy Space Center. We had a really good time. If you plan on coming here, plan on spending the whole day. In fact, get here as early as you can because that bus tour part and taking over to the Apollo area is going to take half a day at least. So you want to make sure you have time to see some of the other displays. We didn't get through everything here in our day here. Um, we could have easily spent another couple hours um, during the day. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. And subscribe. So you can see future videos. Also hit that bell and we'll give you notifications when we post new videos. We try to post videos on a weekly basis. So come back and check us out in a week and we'll have something new for you. Bye. Until then, we'll see you down the road. That's right. Goodbye.